Freaky friends! Morning, freaky friends! Do you see what I see? Do you see what Skippy sees? I see a neo, a neophilosaurus. Uh, it's an ammonite, one of the ones that swam through the water. Uh, it might break apart on me. It's still in situ. Uh, I wanted to show you guys. Uh, I, these are the ones that I've talked about that when we find the neos, a lot of times there are predator marks on the neo. From, I guess, I don't know why, maybe they were the tasty ones. Maybe the other ones never tasted very good and the neos were thin enough where you could bite into them and they had a good taste. Like some of our fish taste good and some taste bad. Okay, I want to show you guys this. It's fine, finely ribbed. Okay, ready? Oh, there still might be more. I'm going to have... Oh, here we go. Okay. It's not going to be as nice as I thought. But the center is pretty well probably gone. But... Uh, here we go. Here we go. We'll see what that is. Okay. See, I was right about predator marks. Do I know my freaky fossils or what? Here, I'll show you. Again. As soon as I wet it, you'll probably be able to see what I'm talking about. Okay, you ready? You ready, freaky friends? See? Looks like a face on it, and it's probably on the other side, too. That's why they get broke up so, so much. So I got a couple pieces. It's not going to be too well, too good of one. That's why they're rare because they get fed on and they get chewed apart and pooped out. And then some fossil hunter, 80 million years later, maybe if he's lucky, he will go out and find one, like I just did. Rock on, freaky friends. Keep following Skippy the fossil freak. Like, subscribe. See. See what I was meaning about bite marks kind of on both sides? So, huh? That's what happened. Now, 80 million late, years later, full circle, Skippy's biting the ammonite that was chewed by a fish. Hmm, imagine that.